Hello, today I'm here with a new video and if you don't know who I am, my name is Lisa. I'm a cruelty review YouTuber that does a lot of makeup content. But today, it's not makeup content. I did, over a little bit of half a year ago, I did a year weights collection video. And I'm going to do the same today. But today I am just going to talk about all the things I have from Ask and Embla. And some of these were in the first video I did, but I have bought a lot of new things from Ask and Embla and I didn't want to make this to such a super long video, so I was thinking to do this by brand. So this video is only from Ask and Embla and I'm going to do two more videos, I think. One from... yeah, you will see that. It will come. I don't know when, but it will come. So I'm just going to show you the things I have. So it's mostly ear weights. It is three pairs of plugs as well. And I will leave Ask and Embla down in the description, of course. And I just love what they have. They are... they do amazing, <laughs> amazing jewelry for stretched ears. So we can actually start with the first one, the ones I have in. These are teardrop tunnels. I have hair in them. <laughs> These are not my favorite because I, I don't know. And oh my god, it's ear through them. I think they look good, but I don't use them that often. I have 20 millimeters in my ears, if you didn't know. I don't know what it is in inches, but yeah. I think these are maybe 19 millimeters. I'm guessing, but yeah. These are some teardrop tunnels and they look good, but it's nothing that I use super often. Next up are these tunnels. I think they look really good and they are super comfortable. I these are kind of new to me. I bought this in the beginning of the summer and I think they look good. And I don't really like steel tunnels that much. I think they are not comfortable at all, but these are really, really nice to have. And I think they look good. They don't look like too big, but they don't look super small either. And they are, as I said, really comfortable. They are not that heavy either. So it feels really good to have them in and it's a normal set of tunnels. They have a lot of different colors on these. I did pick up gray. I think they are called smoke gray maybe. Next up are these saddle hangers and <laughs> these I... I think saddle hangers look super cool on others. I don't know if they look super cool on me. But these have a little bit of texture. I think they are called croissant saddle hangers on their website. The thing with these are they are really comfortable to have in. It doesn't like stretch or anything and yeah, they are really nice to the ear so I like that and I've used these quite a lot actually. More than I thought I was going to do but mostly because they are so easy to take in and out. They are comfortable and I like how they look. I think I have these in 18 maybe. So I have 20 millimeters in my ears, but I think these are in 18. And it's just because I don't want them to look too tight. I think it looks better if you go down one or two sizes than take your actual size when you are having saddle hangers in. That is just what I think, but I think it looks better when you don't have your size because then I think they are looking a little bit too big. Then we go into the ear weights and we can start with one that is kind of my favorite and this I have shown in the other video and these are my T-Rex and these are super heavy, super big but I just love how they look. I think they look so freaking cool. They are not the most comfortable to wear because they are so heavy. But like for a video or just go out and eat, I think they are super, super amazing. They are a little bit tricky to put in the ear because the T-Rex has teeth. But when you, well, when you just have them in, 
when you just get it in nothing to complain about at all so I think these are like the coolest ones that I have I just to go, I think they are available in gold as well I can't remember but I think so but yeah the little t-rex next up we have some that are really tricky to put in the ears but they look really good when you will have them in and these ones are really light so it doesn't feel like heavy in the ear at all maybe it look a little bit heavy but they are really light and i think they just look cool it feels more like a normal earring than an ear weight the only thing that i don't like about these they are super like annoying to put in but they fall out super easy and that bugs me a little bit but i think they look good they ho have one smaller size i think but i think this is a good size and i think they look good next up is one that this is an earring but you can of course use it as an ear weight the only thing is i don't think it look super good when it's in the ear because this is so thin the part you put in your ear because you can use it as a normal earring I will try to use these together with a steel tunnel maybe or another kind of tunnel but these look so elegant it's like a little bee hive I just think they are so nice and these are not that heavy at all it's just that this one is not super comfortable but they aren't like supposed to be an ear weight but I think they look really 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 good these are actually one of my favorites i just need to like figure out i don't know if you can see it but my ear is a little bit irritated with this in and i don't know but they look so good i need to try to fix this then i have this super simple little orb these are one of the most comfortable ear widths you can have it was a long time when I thought these looked just strange on me, but I actually like them now. These are really comfortable, they are not too heavy, they are not too long. And I just think it looks good. First I was like, it looks so good on others, I thought they looked shit on me, but I think I just needed to get used to it. And now I just think it looks really good, and they are... They are not falling out that easy, which is a good, and they're just really comfortable to wear. Some ear weights are not super comfortable, but these are. And then we have these ones. These are, I think, the most comfortable ear weight I have. They are not too heavy, but they are not too light, and these really like stay in your ear and are super duper comfortable and they are not too long not too short and it just stay there and I really do like them I think these are the ones that I've used the most because these I sometimes use like an everyday basis because they are not going to fall out and they are not too heavy and I have actually thinking about buying some more that are like this closed because these are just super easy to have. The other three that I have left are all moons and we can start with the first one I bought. These I fell in love with when I first saw them and these sit really good in the ear because it has like a little thing so it doesn't fall off but they are kind of heavy and the only thing I don't like about these I often like it stuck in things and it hurts so bad. But I think they look really cool and I usually have them these ways. I think you can have it like the other way but I think this looks the best. So because these are a little bit heavy I decided to buy two other moons. So we can start with the silver ones and these are so, so cool and what I like more about these, these aren't that heavy and not that big and like the hole here isn't as big in the other one so these I don't think I ever get caught in something with so that is good and I really love how these looks and they are super comfortable 
not heavy at all and they really do stay in the ear so I'm so happy that I finally bought them and I love that they are a little bit like rough and not smooth and then I also have the same moon but in gold gold isn't the thing that I use the most I mostly used silver but I bought these in gold because I had the silver moons and sometimes I actually use gold so I bought them in gold as well and these are exactly the same as the silver ones and if I'm going to use gold I often use these I have some other gold ear weights but these are the only one in gold that I have from Aske and Embla and I don't have so much more to say about these because I just talked about the silver ones but really nice and that was actually all I have from Ask and Embla. I can really recommend them. They have good quality, all the things that I have at least. Nothing has broken, lost the color, getting dull. So everything I bought from Ask and Embla is still looking really, really good. And I think they have such cool jewelry. So yeah, that was all for this video. I really hoped you liked it. And I will see you when the next one comes up but I want to talk a little bit more about piercings because it's a big passion of mine. I really love ear weights especially and different kind of plugs. So yeah, I really hope you liked this video and if you're not subscribing to my channel please do so you don't miss any of my videos and I hope I'll see you in the next one. Bye!